Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Wix website with AI. Wix is a great and powerful well-known website builder that you can use to build your own websites for free. And it's also user-friendly and beginner-friendly. It doesn't require any coding or it has a coding section if you are into that. But however, if you don't know any coding, you can build a powerful website using a drag and drop method. Now here I'm on my uh, Wix Studio or Wix dashboard and these are all the sites that are created earlier. As you can see, it's pretty easy. I created many websites to test various functionalities. And to go to this page, it's pretty simply. All you need to do is to sign up to Wix. Now this is the Wix website. This is how it looks like uh, for a new user. All you need to do is to go to Wix.com and then log in if you already have an account or click on get started to create your account. So if I click on get started right here, I can create a new account from email and a password or I can sign up with Google or Facebook. So once you've created your account, either by email or Google or Facebook and confirmed your email, if you sign in or sign up with email, it's pretty easy and straightforward. And once you do, you will land on your uh, Wix dashboard. Now we are back here on my main dashboard. Now to create a new website, it's pretty easy. Simply click on create new site. Here you can use a ready-made template from a studio template, or you can start building your website from a blank canvas. However, what we are interested in or what we want to focus on in this video is using the AI website builder. And that will be found here in the use Wix editor option. So click on it and you will be redirected to the AI wizard. You can click here to start chat or start like building your website from prompts on with AI or start without chatting and build it manually. We'll click on start chat here and the uh, wizard or the here, the AI will ask you a couple of questions based on which it'll generate a website for you. And don't worry at the end, if you want to change elements in your website, you can do so easily. Now, uh, first of all, what do you want to call your site? Let's call it anything like uh, fitness, uh, fitness fire. I'm just making up names, uh, but in order to show you. And in each question, you can ask to help uh, with the answer or skip the question and or end chat and continue. Okay. Next question. Now, can you tell me about your fitness business? Let's say I'm a fitness coach and I want to create a website to uh, sell my programs, have like educational videos, blogs and stuff like that. As you can see here, the site profile will be building progressively as we go on the right. Say I want to create a website to sell my fitness programs and have a blog where I can publish fitness related topics as well as workout videos. So that uh, basically means that I need to have a section, an e-commerce section to sell and be able to sell and receive payments and a blog section to be able to uh, post like articles. OK. And in this step, try to be as detailed as possible. OK, now uh, well, who is your target audience? Let's say people of all ages who want to learn about fitness and nutrition and want to lose fat and build muscle. Okay, enter. And as you can see here, the profile is starting to show. So the site type is a fitness blog, booking online store for, of course, program pricing plans, online programs and blogs. Okay, now to the next question. Do you have any specific branding or design preferences for your website? Um, here, try to be clear about what design language or what design type you want. I want a vibrant and energetic looking website, modern look with big 
text and lots of moving elements okay as i told you uh, this is not like a specific requirement i'm just making up a description as we go okay and at any like stage you can end the chat and continue with the information that the wizard already has now what is your unique selling point for your fitness programs here we can skip this question i can answer it but i just want to show you what will happen if i skip it if you want to answer it you can just say whatever you want let's say i i uh, care about people and i want to uh reach more people and uh, educate them about fitness and how to take care of their body for example but we'll skip this question okay great you are all set now go to dashboard and it's now generating your website with everything images color styles uh, text uh, and so on and now it generated the website and i'm on the main dashboard and here you can edit uh, this is like the back end of the website. You can edit everything, adding custom domain name, add your first service, adding the uh, programs, con uh, like controlling booking calendar, uh, payment methods, add catalogs, and so much more. However, let's first go ahead and finish designing the website. So design site. And here you can generate a design with AI or custom from a customized uh, template. So let's generate a design from AI. And here it'll going to generate the looks and feel of your website based, of course, on the information or briefing that you gave the wizard in the last questions and the site description as well. Okay, it's doing its magic now. Just give it like a minute or two. And as you can see here, elements are starting to pop up and starting images starting to form. Okay looks um looks good enough if you don't like it you can make it a little different or you can regenerate the site uh, altogether so let's try to regenerate it let's say you don't like it okay now that's more like it i like this uh site better okay you can make a little make it a little different or uh regenerate or continue this design and as you can see uh, here the design is already set with everything and uh, if you continue with this design of course you can uh, manually edit the uh, specific elements that you don't like now let's try to make it a little different okay so it'll keep like the same look and feel but it's it changed like some images uh, the image like uh, positioning and uh, stuff like that let's say i like it this way continue with this design okay and here it generates like a uh, professional uh, or a custom domain name and here i can uh, set it up let's go to continue uh, using the domain name of course i need to purchase it first this is not for free or let's continue to the editor here and here it prepares your website here in the editor as i told you uh, if you want that is if you want to like edit specific elements and after a few moments here the website is finally loaded in the editor now here i can add elements i can add sections i can view the pages and menu i can uh, edit items in the site design let's say i want to edit the font colors here or the site theme color uh, let's go and um, change the theme and here i can choose between many color palettes let's choose for example this one and as you can see here the color or the elements changed color let's choose this one okay looks like this one is better you can uh like try different styles see which one is better for you let's try this one okay good okay this one i like the best let's keep it and let's go back here and you can uh change the colors theme or the text theme so let's change the font here the heading font let's make it this one as you can see it changed and the paragraph font let's uh, change it to this one and as you can see the text in the menu here and on the button changed and you can go ahead and customize all the uh, items that you want now you can add elements here let's add for example uh, you can add text image button strip decorative uh, items like uh, these uh, like icons and stuff like that and you can even add uh, like ready-made sections if you want to 
Now let's add, for example, um, let's actually add one of these shapes here. Okay. So some decorative shapes and you can add a link to them. You can customize them or change the basic shape. You can add it, add the styles or design them. You can add animation if you want. And you can even for each element here, click on it to like move it around. Let's say I like the text to be a little bit lower. I can edit the text. I can add link to text. I can double click to uh, edit text or so get fit now. And if I want to change any image, clicking on it and I can click on change background or manage columns here, add animations and so much more. And once I'm happy, I can publish the website with the URL here. So click on publish. It'll generate the website with a uh, URL that like Wix generates for you. If you want to design your own logo, you can go ahead and get one or you can uh, add a custom domain name that you bought from external website in the websites dashboard. Here you can click on view website and everything is done. That's how easy it is to create a website on Wix using AI.